down there. Just stopped here in the uh, stairwell, stairway, stair very well. Get it? And uh, I'm gonna do a little meditation here. And there's uh, the stairs, thanks to Sarah. And uh, maybe I'll just come up a little bit. I don't know what the. Uh, <clears throat> there's the wild things. There. There's uh, Linda Addison poetry. There she is. Yay. <clears throat> and uh, there's uh, Dave Chorney photo. And I'm going to set this up maybe right here above Dave, so we'll see how that works. I'll do a little meditation in the, uh, in the stairwell. Uh, yeah, it'll work a little bit in the stairwell. <clears throat> See how that works. That's good. I can sit next to Linda here. And, uh, <coughs> I just did some smudging, and, uh, Darla is starting a meditation session, series, class, offering right now at this moment. I thought we'd do a meditation as well about uh, beginnings and openings and uh, bring ourselves into a place uh, from which to begin. And generally what I'm looking for is uh, authentic <coughs> expression, movement, <clears throat> rather than uh, ego-driven. So I'm resting without expectation. Resting not in patience, but in presence. And so the sense here is of a start, right? A next step, a next level. So I'm in the stairway, moving up a level or down a level, whichever. <clears throat> and so to be on that precipice or on that threshold from that step before the next step, it's very easy to bring your mind and heart ahead or hold one behind as you step forward in fear. <clears throat> the practice here meditatively is just to come to a current and complete or relatively complete assessment of how and who you are. And this will act as the benediction or the salutation or the sanctification of the processes to come. How and who I am. And I'm asking this with my heart. I'm asking with my mind. I'm asking with my body. I'm asking of my heart. I'm asking of my mind. I'm asking of my body. I'm asking with my body. Of my heart. Of my mind. How and who I am. At this moment. As best as I can apprehend. <clears throat> in this present moment into which I invite and in which I harbor no patience for any other moment. I 
and so I haven't taken a particular mudra or done particular types of movement, just sitting. And for me, I'm sitting right on the edge of the step, so I definitely have this sense of you know, I could, you know, slip. Uh, so I'm just kind of just barely on the step. <clears throat> and it's really keeps uh, keeps seeming a wonderful palette to paint my anxiety on. Uh, but I shan't. It's very easy to have the ego arrive, you know, at a at a moment of beginnings. Here's what I'm going to do. Here's my ritual. Here's my sensor. Here's, you know, my dance, and, uh, my drumming, and my calling of spirit, and so forth. And these can all be fine. But I also notice that people kind of they're excited because they get to play a role, and that takes them out of the moment. And they don't know who and how they are that's going to enter into this new. Um, circumstance, event, you know, process. So, that's my little offering. So, this will uh, soon have more bookcases behind me and there as well. But for now, we have what we have. Thank you for joining in.